So, this is a quick uh, answer film to my YouTube friend, Scoutcrafter, uh, who I watch his channel and inspires me to... Now, how long has he been off telly? Is he still on television? Hmm. Um, this is virtually unopened. I don't use it. I'm not a... I'm not a particular driller of holes, and I'll show you that. Even, even the little booklet is still in there, um, and it has little attachments that you, you pull out, and you see it slides down the side there, and then you do you do whatever you do, whatever the instructions tell you to do. There's one there, and you've got a place to keep it. Uh, there's a drill one, I guess, yeah. What would this be? I'm guessing this would be a knife one. Nice one, a scissors one, yeah, that slits over there. Slots over there. And I'm guessing, yeah, this would be the chisel one that goes down here. So, hmm. Let's, um, oh, the plug goes around there. Let's plug it in. Let's see what it does, shall we? Oh, there's a spare wheel there, look. And a little... It's even got a little sticker. I mean, like I say, I've never... I've never used... I've never used any of it. Let's plug it in, see if it runs. It should run. Let's, um... <laughs> Hold on a minute. Hold on, let's plug this thing in. Right. Yeah, and this is what it runs like. Direction of whatever. Let's do a chisel, shall we? Oh, look, there's a there's an attachment on that, isn't there? For something, it's even got the little tape that holds it together. Do I think I'll get that to work? Probably not. No. So that goes in there. You can see the little wheel. I think you put the chisel in there, don't you? And uh, that runs. And that sharpens it. And this does you an angle. Uh, what do we say? What do we, this one's a drill. So you put, the, you put your drill in here. Use the side of the stone, look. Yeah. And then that would be the knife attachment. This would be the knife attachment. So the scissors attachment. Put that in there. And then... But as you know, drilling isn't my thing. If I want to make a hole, I'd rather cut a piece off, put a ready-made hole there, and that. I'm a weld it, bodge it, burn it, hammer it. <laughs> Not really. I appreciate. I have enjoyed doing my little wooden projects, but I'm not. I'm just a, you know, a bodger, a bodger bill. Yeah. Well, and the nuts and bolts make, as you can, as you've guessed already. There's nothing nuts and bolts can't make here. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it don't look nice. It'll do the job. But that's about it. Anyway, I thought I would just do a quick answer to a question. So, hmm. I'm going to do that now. Tommy, where is Tommy Walsh? Um, and has anybody got one of these? Does anybody use one of these? Plus plug rings a bell. Hmm. Anyway, I just thought you might be interested in that. But I'm not really a sharpening person, Al. And my drills. I've got a sort of a system now with drills. I've got... There's my drills. I tend to use them once and throw them in there. So these are my used once drills. If I want to drill a hole, I'll go in here 
um, it's always potluck. It either will drill, great, or it won't drill. One of my biggest failings is if it won't drill, I tend to throw it back in the drawer. <laughs> that's no, that's not the ideal situation because I have these two tins. These are full of drills and all these are all um, X. X, I know where these have come from, an X engineer's drill. And they're all really good and sharp. So I've still got a good supply of them. And should I need to go bigger, I've got, hold on. Let's hold a bit of light up to that. I've got another supply of drills in there, ready to go. And then I have got here somewhere another whole load of drills in one of these jars somewhere near the taps. Oh yeah, taps and dies and drills. And I keep, don't knock the sh I keep drills in here as well. Look, these again are brand new. And not that I see they're all dipped to the tip of them is dipped in plastic. The whole of that is dipped in plastic. Look, see that? So I'm not short of drills. It's not really a, and I know who's talking about ch chiseling, but I tend to burn and cut. I don't really chisel anything. Hmm. So I thought you might find that answer for my, um, my YouTube friend, Scout Crafter. If you get a chance, have a look at his channel. Well, it's one of those things, you'll have a look at it and whatever he's talking about this week, you might think, oh, that's not for me. I say, give him six or look at six or 10 of his programs and you'll get a feel of it, of his films and you'll get a feel of what he does. And it's amazing the, the subjects that he covers and uh, the knowledge that he passes on. Anyway, right. I hope that, uh, John, I hope that uh, answers your question. <laughs>